Hey guys and welcome back to Everybody Has Gone to the Rapture. Okay, so we just had that cut scene in the house with Wendy and um, Stephen and he is still looking he's looking at a place for um him and Kate. Mum's like, no, not a good idea. I want you to be with Lizzie. <laughs> oh, where would we be without mums? Um, I saw Lizzie coming out this way. Um, okay, so we came from that way. Oh, there's a radio over here. Physical changes are evident. Although the butterfly burn is now faded, I can clearly see the change in my pores up close. As I record these words, I can feel myself hearing them as if for the first time, as if I'm both speaker and listener simultaneously. I am a scientist. I can only deal with the evidence I have. And this points in one simple direction. It's not in the observatory. Yeah, okay. I think, I mean, I think we pretty much gathered there, hadn't we? That it was a little bit more than an entity outside of things. It seems to be more like a... Um, <clears throat> I, I don't know. Like, it seems to be much more grand than, than like, a, a being or... Yeah, anything like that. Kate. Kate, can you hear me? Listen, I'm trying to make things right. I've isolated myself. I'm in the old bunker at the substation. Just keep this band clear. If it's still alive, I'll try and check in every hour. Kate, I've convinced them to use the gas. I, I didn't know how else to stop it. I couldn't save them. Kate, it's in us, too. I've made arrangements for myself after the strike, after I finish the job. You need to think of that, too. Okay. So he's basically ordered a strike to take everything and everybody out. Um, yeah, he, he's trying to... Whatever they've done, he's trying to fix things. He's trying to get rid of it now. this place? The Seventh Whistler? Another bar tavern? You look well. Oh. I don't. But thank you. You too. How are you sat there? Nothing, Nothing changes around here. I mean, it's great to be back. It still feels like home, I suppose. In a funny kind of way. It's been a long time, Stephen. Last time you saw me, I could still walk properly. You look pretty good to me. Stop it. For what it's worth, I'm sorry about how things worked out. Or it didn't. Or didn't, right. Do you think you made a mistake, Stephen? My mum tells me it's never too late to change things. To put things right. Funny. It's just what she said to me the other day. I have been wondering what she oh meant by that. That's embarrassing. Sorry. Oh, maybe I should go. Why? Stephen, we're both married. I don't think this is a good idea. What is it? We're just two old friends having a drink, that's all. Okay, so that must be when he just came back. And um, he's met up with Lizzie. 
Um, I guess we'll go back out this way. Seems to be quite a bit darker now, like it's heading into like early evening sort of thing. So where's Steven gone? Can we check? Oh, can't go in the back there. So we'll, we'll head down this way. What's this? Public footpath. Oh, here we go. There he goes over there. Can we go that way or? Carry on this way. I can hear a radio. I think this kind of seems like um, it's not really so much of a path. Yeah, we'll go back through the fence. I can definitely hear radio transmitting from somewhere. Yeah, there goes another cool tuna. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Pressure in my eyes again. I can't move my legs, can't feel my face. When I collapsed, the light was waiting for me there. Caught me, lowered me here. Now it's pooling around my feet, watching me. The printers are spewing out page after page of zeros. It's frightening too. It'll be okay. It'll be fine. I'll look after you. It's alone. Right, that was a little weird, but um, yeah. So she's referring to whatever it is as um, as like a a living, feeling, being thingy ish. <laughs> um, yeah, and from what from what you know, she was saying, it seems like she feels quite connected to this thing. So, where did we see Stephen before? He was frolicking around that way. Exacting standards, Dr. Collins. 
Maybe you just need to give us ordinary humans a break. What? Ordinary humans like Lizzie Graves? Did you really think that I wouldn't find out? Frank told me, or did you forget there's one person in this shithole who actually talks to me? Kate, it was just a dream. Don't bother, Stephen! Oh, for Christ's sake. Kate, slow down! You were engaged to her, Stephen. You nearly married oh, her! Oh, come on, it was just a dream. Then why the hell did you lie to me about because it? Because I knew you'd be mad, and then it would end up in a row. You wanted to focus on the event tonight. Oh, so you were actually doing me a favor. Wow, I guess I just forgot to say thank you. Do not treat me like I'm an idiot! You're overreacting. I know, I know you're stressed. Just... don't. You keep away from me, I'm not gonna let you release from me. Kate. Kate, come on, this is crazy! All right, so Kay found out about the drink that these two had, that Stephen and Lizzie had, and is clearly not very happy about it. Uh, yeah, okay. So let's carry on then. What do we got down here? To Tipworth and Haverton. Okay, what's happening down here? There goes that stack of pallets again. Jeez, it gets around, huh? Telephone. Yeah, cured up. It's all over the valley. Don't you get that? This isn't some abstract thing. Whatever came down into the tower has got out. They've quarantined the whole valley. It's right here in the observatory. It's out in the world. It's adapting and spreading. Do you understand? No, we can't turn it away. It's come too far. Okay, people are disappearing. Shut it down. If you won't help me, I'll do it on my own. I'm gonna route all the power back through Tower 6. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, it's trying to break through again. Wait. <laughs> okay, so Kate has got really attached to this thing. She's determined. She's gonna have... She's gonna have this thing or be with this thing or... Whoop, something like that. Um... Okay, well, this is about all we've got time for for this episode. Um, I've really got to watch my times. I keep over-recording. Yeah, I think maybe the next thing might be to invest in a capture card. There's 15 minutes, just, you know, it's just, it's good. It's just not quite long enough. Um, but anyway, thank you guys for joining. Hope you guys enjoyed, and we'll see you next time.